Uh, well, I'm just looking to vote, participate in the process. You know, as a citizen, I want to contribute uh, in ways that I believe in, you know. I would like to see tensions lower, just broadly. Um, no matter your political party, I think there's a lot more we could do to get along with each other. Uh, and that would be more productive. Because that's really what I want is productivity. Whatever, I don't want to get into specifics, but just... Uh, I want to see progress on just everything, you know, because there's a lot more we could do to improve on in this country, in this state, in, you know, the world in general. And uh, I would just like to see more unity, more cooperation, whatever, in whatever form that may take. I feel that there's a lot of policies need to be changed in our country and also in our state. And I just feel that if you're a registered voter, don't sit at home, get out and cast your vote and make your opinion known. If you don't vote, then our opinion should, it won't matter. If we don't vote, then we don't have a decision on what happens with our Congress. And I feel if a person does not vote, then they shouldn't have a right to complain if anything goes sour. So they definitely need to make their opinions heard. This is my granddaughter and she's been learning about voting and the reason why I bought her is so that she can see how the voting polls actually work for a dog, some real life person, and what it, you know, because she has already learned about the candidacy, the congressmen, uh, speakers, and all that in school. And she got a good grade on it, and I thought I'd bring her and show her exactly how a real voting poll is. In fact, she wanted to vote, didn't you? I need to vote for Donald Trump. But why can't you? Because I'm not 18. And where'd you learn that at? School. I'm here to make a change. Uh, the, it's been uh, not the way it's, well, I've been wanting it to, so I voted to make a change in the presidency. It's definitely time for a change. Is there anything specific you'd like to see come out of today? Um, just a more united uh, America. I think we've kind of uh, all gone our own ways, and I'd like to see us come back together as a nation. Well, I vote all the time, but I figured there was going to be a lot of mail-in voting, and the way the mail is, I didn't trust it, so that's why I'm actually voting in person today. I, I think we're in a pretty good shape now, and I hate to see it change. I've seen a lot, been around a long time, and uh, life is never easy, and people expect too much without working for it. William's not very happy because mommy's voting, which they wanted, she wanted them to see the voting process, but he wants to mark on the ballot and help her vote, help her mark the ballot. And we know we don't need extra marks on the ballot. So anyway, I walked him out so that not everyone has to listen to him cry. It was important to bring them. Oh, so that um, they could see that it was an important thing to be a part of the process and to vote whenever you can vote. Uh, because I think she thinks voting is important. Basically, I like I like our president who's in there right now, and I want to try to keep him in there because uh, I, I believe the Democrats have uh, different ideals than the way I want the country to be run. So that's why that's why I'm voting for uh, Donald Trump today. Usually in, in in Highland here, it's it's relatively easy to vote the day of the election, so that's why I opted to go with that. It's important to me specifically because for me, is as a personal view, I've been on both sides i would say democrat republican i would say more of like a household view economic view and the more the more that i progress in my life and the more successful i get the more important it is to me to understand where i came from and so that's why i personally choose to vote democrat i'm just hoping for maybe some change where we can more come together and so there's not as much hatred or people dividing like they are now.